Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from La Liga Smart Bank. It's Real Oviedo and they take on Las Palmas. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, it's the basic 4-4-2 formation, but played well, it can be really effective. And key to its success are the wide midfield players. They have to be fit, they need to be able to run with the ball, and they need to double up with their fullbacks. It's a really tough role for them. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4 5 1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And they kick off here. That's a good looking ball. Montoro. Henrik. Determined block. Alex Suarez. Vieira. Well, it looked so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Well, he always has to be regarded as a dangerous opponent, so what should we expect to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. It did look on for them, but not to be. Cardona. On to Vitolo. Omanuke Mfulu. Vieira. And the keeper did more than enough. taken short this looks promising and a body in the way hey. it's a short one Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Sydney. Can he convert? And stuffing out in Jeff. Loyal Dis. Cardona. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Good pressure high up the pitch. There is the goal to open the scoring. Who can 
say they don't deserve to be in front. Well, as you'll see, it's not a good pass out from the back. It's on the wrong side of the plane he's trying to pass it to. It's intercepted, and it's a good finish. Yes, of course it is, but it's not good defending all round. Are back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Firing it towards goal. And a corner kick, the referee's verdict. They favoured a short one here. Omanuke and Fulu. Will it be? And a goal! The quick one too! And they've turned this game on its head! Well, here's the replay, and it's a really good bit of play. Watch how he turns his marker and then has the composure to finish. That's a top-class goal. now and back on the way clear foul play and as a result a free kick forthcoming well that could be the final warning well he needs to be careful now next foul and it's a card And very adept at holding the ball up in this manner. Alex Suarez. Well, as you can see, the visitors have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Yes, it might be on for them once more. And he'll take efforts like that all day long. Loyo Dis. Can he put it away? Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. And there's the delivery, and still dangerous. And just leaning back a bit, and over the bar. Sanchez can he play it in oh a vital interception what about the stoppage time situation two minutes the word Vieira making progress is it going to be and a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant.
going short. And it's Vitolo with it. And he could be in proper trouble here. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, there's a sound reason why we're focusing on him. He's making his presence felt in attack, Stuart. Well, he's been a joy to watch so far. He's got so much ability, and it was also a very good finish for his goal. He's been excellent. And now... So back underway here, into the second half. Luis Mee. And the textbook interception. Now, let's see what they can do here. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Loyo Dis. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Defenders need to cover. That's a fairly easy save for any keeper to make. He's very adept at protecting the ball. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Ritolo. Loyo Dis. And he has options available. Terrific block. Luis Me. And possession lost, intercepted. They need to get tighter. Vieira! In it goes! But it will not stand. Offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. <laughs> Substitution time it is here. Alex Suarez. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. And a substitution in the offing. Creative look about this. Well, didn't go to plan in the end. And it's Vitello with it. And that is offside. So deciding to make a per change at this juncture. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Well, no stopping it. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. And the danger is averted. 
Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. Noyo Dis. Omanuke and Pulu. And that was a very fine read. Rodri Tarin. And here's Montoro. Borja Baston. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Cardona. On the ball, Vieira. And he's in. And searching for his second, but the keeper equal to the task. Well, he's looking really lively, isn't he? Every time he gets the ball, he looks a threat. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Going short. Vitolo. And the cross not quite imaginative enough. Vieira. Well, nothing productive, really. Well, the referee has instructed the fourth official to put two minutes on the board. Henrik. The concession of a corner here. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Henrik. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. And well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, I'm not concerned about him missing a few chances. The main thing is he kept on getting into the right areas and he scored a very good goal as well.